Hey, so if you're here, you have already created your account. If you're not sure what menu is yet, we will advise you to subscribe to this channel so you can view other tutorials. So after you have uh, set up your account or logged in, you're going to see the main screen. And now we're going to show you how to edit your menus. You're going to select my restaurant. You're going to go to edit menu. And here you can see the categories. Here you can add another category. We're going to see default menus for each. And here you're going to see the option so you can edit each category. This option is in case your category is not available at the moment, you can hide it. And for this uh, button, you're going to see all the um, the options that you have in each category. So let's go back to categories and edit. Okay, so this will be burgers category. Uh, you can add your own image of your different set of burgers and click save. Okay, so now uh, that we have the burger category, we're going to edit the dishes. Okay, so we're going to enter the name of each dish. For example, Just enter your ingredient and click enter. Then on the description, you're going to add Okay, so you're going to describe your, your dish. You're going to add the price for your dish. And here you're going to also see a default picture. You can erase it. You can add your, your own picture. Okay, so after you have uploaded your image of your dish, you can see that here you can also edit any other choices that the dish may come with. Let's see. So if the burger, you can um, have uh, certain dressings. Um, Caesar, click enter, like all the dressings that you have for the dish and the client will be able to select the options. Okay, if you have certain different types of um, bread.
then there's an example for the choices and you can go on like with the types of cheese and everything that you can um, offer for each type of dish. So just remember that all these choices, they are optional. Uh, your dish might be standard and may not come with all these different choices. And if it does, just add them. Okay, and right here we're going to see additional features in case the customer wants extra ingredients, extra side orders, anything extra, it's going to be added here. And the last option is send to either cooks and waiters for the kitchen display uh, whenever the dishes, whenever it's dishes, or if you select only waiters, uh, it's because uh, only them, they're going to prepare the beverages, the alcohol, the drinks. Okay, but in this case, it's burgers, so we're going to click cooks and waiters click save and there you go you have created your own category you have uh, learned how to edit dishes you have your own dish right here and let me show you a fabulous tool that menu has this button will help you manage your uh, inventory each time you have an order you're going to click on the button and all the ingredients from your dish will be discounted from the inventory and we're also going to have a tutorial just for that so keep watching and subscribing to the channel So perfect, you have now learn, learned how to create a category inside a menu and a, your dishes. So you are ready to move on to a different category or tutorial and keep subscribing to our channel so you can learn every menu tool. Thank you.